Sunil Gavaskar was born on July 10, 1949, in a middle-class family in Bombay, now Mumbai, India. His father, Manohar Gavaskar, was a famous novelist and his mother, Meenal Gavaskar, was a schoolteacher. Sunil was the youngest of four siblings and had two brothers and a sister. Sunil was an average student at school, but was an avid sportsperson. He was an all-rounder who loved playing cricket and hockey and was also a talented swimmer. He studied at Bombay University, where he captained the college's cricket team. Early Cricket Career Sunil Gavaskar's cricketing career began as a teenager, when he joined the Bombay Cricket Club in 1966. He made his first-class debut for Mumbai in 1966, and made an immediate impression by scoring a century in his first match. He went on to become one of the most successful batsmen in Indian cricket history, and made his test debut for India against West Indies in 1971. He soon established himself as a reliable batsman, scoring centuries in his first two test matches. International career. Sunil Gavaskar's international career spanned over two decades, from 1971 to 1987. During this period, he achieved numerous records and milestones in test cricket. He was the first batsman to score 10,000 test runs and the first to score 30 centuries. He also captained the Indian team in 47 test matches and was the first Indian captain to lead the team to victory overseas. Gavaskar's most famous feat was his record-breaking feat of scoring 774 runs in the six test series against West Indies in 1978-79. He was also the first batsman to score a century in all ten test-playing nations. Achievements. Sunil Gavaskar is widely regarded as one of the greatest batsmen of all time. He was the first batsman to score 10,000 test runs and the first to score 30 centuries. He was also the first batsman to score a century in all 10 test playing nations. In addition to his batting achievements, he was also a successful captain. He led the Indian team to victory in 47 test matches, including its first ever overseas test win in 1979 against the West Indies. Sunil Gavaskar is married to Marshneel Gavaskar and the couple has two sons, Rohan and Narayan. Sunil is an avid reader and is also a sports commentator. He is also an active philanthropist and is involved in numerous charitable organizations. Style of play. Sunil Gavaskar was a technically sound batsman who was renowned for his defensive technique and ability to bat for long periods of time. He was also a brilliant runner between the wickets and was considered one of the greatest fielders in the history of cricket. Controversies. Sunil Gavaskar was involved in a few controversies during his playing career. In 1976, he was accused of ball tampering during a test match against England. However, he was later cleared of all charges. In 1981, he was involved in a heated argument with West Indian fast bowler, Michael Holding, during a test match. Retirement Sunil Gavaskar retired from international cricket in 1987, after playing a total of 125 test matches and 108 one-day internationals. He retired as the highest run scorer in test cricket with 10,122 runs and 34 centuries. Post-retirement after his retirement from international cricket, Sunil Gavaskar became a successful commentator and analyst. He is one of the most respected commentators in the world and is currently a member of the International Cricket Council's Cricket Committee. He is also a successful author and has written several books on cricket. Legacy 
Sunil Gavaskar is widely regarded as one of the greatest batsmen of all time. He was the first batsman to score 10,000 test runs and the first to score 30 centuries. He was also the first batsman to score a century in all 10 test playing nations. His record-breaking feat of scoring 774 runs in the six-test series against West Indies in 1978-79 is considered one of the greatest achievements in cricket history. He is also an inspiration to many aspiring cricketers and is respected both on and off the field. Interesting facts. He could have become a fisherman. Sunil Gavaskar was mistakenly swapped with another child after his birth but was later found sleeping beside a fisherwoman. West Indian Rohan Kanhai was Sunil Gavaskar's idol and he also named his only son Rohan Gavaskar after him. Sunil Gavaskar played a lead role in a Marathi movie titled Savli Primachi. Sunil Gavaskar did the job of a match referee in one test and 05 ODI before becoming a commentator. He also tried his hand in writing and has written four books. The best fielder of his era. Sunil Gavaskar's first runs were leg buys. Gavaskar was unaware of the fact that he has scored his 29th test century and equaled Sir Don Bradman's record which stood for more than three decades. He scored reached the milestone of 8,000 runs in the same innings against West Indies and Prime Minister Indira Gandhi personally honoured him on the ground. Batting against England at Old Trafford in 1974, Sunil Gavaskar got a haircut from the umpire, Dickie Bird as his hair was getting in his eyes during the match. Gavaskar is the only player to have scored a century in the first, second, third, and fourth innings of a test match. Dear viewers, we have tried our best to provide you an informative video. Please comment that how did you find this video because your opinion and comments are very important to us. If you like the video, please like and subscribe our channel so that you may be updated for our every informative video. Take care of your good self.